Hi again. Uh, so, I, like I said, we're having storms today, so I'm hoping that this will be the last time we have to reset the stream. But I'm, I'm just going to give it this one. So if we lose connection or whatever, then we'll just we'll start again next week. <laughs> so we'll see how this goes. Uh, give me just a second here, guys. I'm just trying to set a couple of things up. I want to make sure that everybody is set up to go. Um, if you're just coming back, thank you so much for coming back. I really appreciate that. Sandra, good morning. I see you there. Good morning. Thank you for that. Um, I just want to send out another link real quick to those on Facebook that follow us, which, a friendly reminder, if you don't already, um, please make sure you follow us there. Sorry, just sending out that message real quick. And Angel is intently trying to get in the door, so I'm going to let her in here in just a second. Linda, good morning. Thank you so much. Kathy, or I'm sorry, Tracy, good morning. Thank you for coming back. I appreciate that. Give me just a second here to kind of get back to what I was doing here. I apologize for that. We, Like I said, we are having some storms, so I'm kind of anticipating there to be some connection issues. We don't usually have too many issues, but we've been having some weird stuff going on lately. Let me see if Angel will come back. Hi, Ange. Come on in, please. She says no. She walks away. She'll change her mind later. Oi. So, yeah. So, let me uh, get the chat window back up here. Give me a second. Thanks so much for coming back. I appreciate that. There we go. All right. Let's see how long this one lasts. Looks like the colors are a little off this time. I don't remember them being uh, that far off the last time, but it is what it is. We'll see how it goes. I did switch over from my hardwire connection to my wireless connection. So hopefully if we lose the home internet, my phone will pick it up. My um, hotspot on my phone will pick it up. So hopefully there won't be a disconnect there, but we'll have to wait and see. So that's probably why the colors look a little funky. Tracy says, take your time. Tech is testy sometimes. Yes, it is. It is very testy. And, you know, I'm, I'm not super tech savvy. So, <laughs> I'm, kinda, I'm learning on the fly here, guys. Um, I don't really know a lot about this stuff. So, I just kind of learn, learn a little bit at a time. Good news is that we've already finished row four. So, that's good. That's good news. It looks like we've got a couple more that have joined us back. So, thank you so much for that. I don't remember what we were talking about before the internet dropped out. I apologize for that. Um, I know we were talking about the weather. I think it heard me. <laughs> good morning, Marie. Thank you for joining us. Good morning. So, Tari, good morning. Welcome. Yes, new here. Well, welcome. Good morning. I'm so glad you caught us. This is Tar take two because the first one I'm having some internet issues apparently so hopefully things stay the way they're going I do have some kind of weird weather going on here so thank you so much for coming in thank you for that welcome uh, just a reminder for those that are new if you haven't already please make sure you like and subscribe and don't forget to share it with your friends we are at a hundred and oops, hundred and twenty subscribers so far, which is awesome. We just celebrated a hundred subscribers a couple weeks ago. We'll do another big giveaway when we get to two hundred. That's really exciting. Marie says rained all night. Well, yeah, it's it's been kind of. We had some thunder and some lightning this morning, but we didn't really get a hard rain. It did rain. But it didn't really rain hard um, this morning. But it's still cloudy and kind of gross. And just, it's so hot and humid. It's just nasty. So, 
I expect there to be more issues. Like I said, this will be my second attempt. If we lose connection this time, then guys, I'll just see you next week. <laughs> I'm not going to try and mess with it. Um, so we'll, hopefully we'll be able to continue the stream, but if not, um, that's where we're, that's where we're at. Um, speaking of other streams today, don't forget, I think Ian is doing a stream later today. Maybe. I can't remember now. I know, uh, Teresa Louise and Tiffany will have theirs later this afternoon. So make sure you check those guys, those ladies out as well. They are super talented, way more talented than I am. That's for sure. Um, they are so much fun to watch. There's this one. What is happening? My phone just went weird, so I was like, uh oh, what happened? <laughs> I've got some music playing in my my ear here. Um, so that I kinda know when the stream dies. Because it's connected to Streamlabs. So it kinda lets me know. So I'm I'm just trying to listen for that intently. So, hopefully nothing happens, but you just never know. So we're on one, two, three, four. We're on row five now. So I'm just trying to lay out the pieces here. This is our tower bridge. Tracy says Ian is tomorrow, I believe. Oh, okay. I know he did a Sunday stream last week, so I wasn't sure if he had done another one this week or not. Thank you for checking on that. Lucas, if you wouldn't mind doing um, exclamation point TB pattern in chat, and then you can pin that up to the top so everybody can uh, get a copy of that pattern if they need it. That would be great. I did that on the last one, but I didn't, uh, I didn't get this one done. Thank you, thank you. And for those of you who are just joining us and did, weren't on the first live stream, Lucas is back. Yay! Lucas is back. It's also his birthday today, so if you haven't already, make sure you say happy birthday to him. He's officially legal. He's 21. So I, I told him we'd take him out to the bar. <laughs> oh, Marie, you are so kind. That is so sweet of you to say thank you. She says, we enjoy watching you too, Danny. We, you have a great personality and a fun channel. Oh, you are so kind. Thank you for that. That's so very nice. I'm glad you guys have a good time. Because I have a great time. You know, who's not going to have a great time sitting in front of a sewing machine? But I have an even better time talking with you guys. So thank you so much for that. Thank you. You guys really make my day. You have no idea how much you guys have done to my mental health this over this past. Gosh, I started the end of January, so what are we on like six and a half months, almost seven. Yeah, you guys have done an amazing job with my, and you don't even know you've done anything, and that's the best part. Marie says, I still haven't caught up on all the replays from last week's live. So many to watch. I know there were a lot of people live last week, myself included. But yeah, there was a lot of lives last week. Lots of live streams. And then this morning, um, this morning I saw a new video, a new video from Sean. I saw that Sean posted a new video. I did not catch it this morning. I was... Unfortunately, I was busy setting up for my life, but if you guys haven't already, make sure you go check out Sean. He's a huge supporter of the channel, which is just so amazing. Um, if you do exclamation point Sean, that's S-E-A-N in chat, you'll get a link if you're not already following him. Oh, I, I went into a small panic. I thought the music died. Whew. Okay, we're still good. Still says we're good, so that's good. But thank you, Marie. That was very kind of you. But yeah, Sean's a huge supporter of the channel. He posted a video this morning that I have not, unfortunately, gotten to watch. Um, and I know he did a live stream yesterday morning, which I started watching, but unfortunately didn't get a chance to finish. I'll probably do that later this afternoon. Super fun guy. Really amazing. Heart of gold. I, I, I adore him. He's just so wonderful. One, two, three... Four. 
goes this way. Thank you, Tracy. Uh, Lucas wants to step away for a minute. No big deal. Oops. There we go. Thank you. So Terry says, I follow Sean and saw him this morning. His koalas are so cute. I know they are so adorable. I wonder if that, I need to send him a note and ask him if that's paper piecing or if that's just piecing because that is, they are just so cute. So cute. Yeah, she says, I'll have to try one one day. Amen. Yes, I would like to try one myself. They're adorable. Oh, looks like Tracy's going to start a heist. For those of you new to the channel, you are earning thimbles as you watch the channel today, as long as you're subscribed. And you have the opportunity to play what we the heist game. Uh, the thimbles is basically just a points program that allows you to earn extra prizes throughout the stream. Two, three, four. Sorry, I was counting. Right now we have a random fat quarter that you can choose from. If you get up to 10,000 points, you can trade those in. I do need to turn that down. I keep forgetting to do it. Um, but yeah, you can enter the heist by doing exclamation point heist space and then the number of points that you're willing to risk. If you're really feeling risky, you can do an exclamation point space all and you can risk them all. Good luck to all of our players. One, two, three, four, five. I'm on row six. Yeah, up like that. Okay. Guys, we only have two rows left. <laughs> this one and one more. That's it. So, Terry, it looks like you have 20 thimbles, so you can risk up to that many in the next game. Just do exclamation point heist space and then the number of thimbles you're willing to risk and then the computer will randomly select a winner um, and award them with some more points. Like I said, I gotta get the the numbers down. 10,000 is just too high, I think. I'm hoping to be a little bit more organized. So those of you that are new to the channel, um, I share this room. This is not just a sewing room. This is also a bedroom. This is my daughter's bedroom. I share this room with her. Um, she is currently home from college, but she's going to be going back to college in a couple of weeks. Once she's back at college, I'll have a little bit more time to spend in here because I, I don't want to invade her privacy. So she lets me use it on Saturdays and Sundays to do my videos and my live streams, but otherwise the room is hers to, you know, do as she pleases, basically. So once she goes back to school, I'll have a little bit more time in this room, so I'll be able to start actually going through all of my boxes and bins and stuff like that and actually start putting more rewards up on the channel. Uh, notions, I'm hoping, some more fat quarters, things like that. So it, I, I'm, I have plans to add more. I just unfortunately haven't had the opportunity to do it yet. One, two, three, four, five. And um, for those of you who missed the last stream, we did have a subscriber who reached out to me and wanted to donate a bunch of items to the channel for giveaways and my goodness they were so gracious they it was the, the package was just massive it was just there was so much in there um so i'm really excited to to kind of dive into that a little bit more and see what's in there and what projects we might be able to do on the channel or what things we might be able to give as giveaways so i'm, I'm really excited to look into that but boy they were so gracious i'm just so grateful to them thank you so much for that Marie reminding everybody to give a thumbs up. Yes, please. Thank you. It does help the channel. And if you're watching the stream after it's already been live, please make sure you leave a comment down below. Say hi. Say hello. Let me know where you're from. I'd love to hear from you guys. I try to respond to every single um, comment if I can. I can't. I can't count today, guys. I'm telling you. Um, I try to respond to every comment that I can, and it's wonderful to hear from you guys. It makes me it totally makes my day when I hear from you. I don't want to grab that one. I actually want to grab this one. Marie says, those blocks are so pretty. Yes, Marie, I'm really liking this fabric. You know, pastel colors are, it's not really my jam. It's its not. This quilt is being made for my other daughter. Not the one I share a room with, but my other daughter. I have twin daughters. Um, this quilt is for Tony, and she picked out the fabric. She picked out the 
pattern. She picked it all out when we were on a family trip to Louisville. Um, unfortunately, that poor store is now closed. It's so terrible to hear that. But um, yes, it is. It's actually really pretty. I, it's growing on me. I was, you know, pastels just aren't really my thing. But I do like the light pink and gray fabric. It is very pretty. I do actually have a couple of jelly rolls of light pink and gray that I haven't really decided what I'm going to do with yet. But now that I'm working with the fabrics and the colors, it's kind of given me a little bit more inspiration of what I could do with them. So, yes, they, they are very pretty. Uh, this particular fabric line is called City of Ballet. If you do exclamation point TB fabric in chat, it'll give you a little bit more information on the fabric line. Oh, Vicki, congratulations, Tracy and Terry. Congratulations to the three of you on winning the heist. Congrats. That gives you a little bit more points to work with. That's so much fun. You can wait five more minutes and try again and earn some more. So much fun. Congrats to you guys. Good morning, Sylvia. Welcome back. Dawn, good morning, my quilt projects. I watched your video yesterday. That was awesome. I was really inspired by that. Thank you for that. Um, you can do exclamation point my quilt projects to uh, get the, get a link to her channel. Make sure you go give her a shout out. Sylvia, I'm sorry that you're not feeling well. She says she's back to sewing. That's great. That's great. You guys are amazing. I can't keep up with the chat. It's going so fast. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, you guys got about five more minutes and then you can try again for that heist. That'll be fun. All right. I like to mark my rows. Uh, we're, so we're working on the rows for the, our tower bridge quilt. We are on one, two, three, four, five. Uh, we are on row five. We just finished row five. We got row six and then that's it. Um, then we're going to sew up the rows together and we c then we can start working on figuring out what we're going to do for borders. I have, excuse me, sorry. I have a solid black and then I have this fabric here that you guys can barely see, but it's this fabric here. It's like the signs of a ballet dance. Um, I have that fabric there for a border as well. So we can start figuring that out. Row five. I like to mark my rows because I will never remember them otherwise. Vicky says, I'm in pain but trying to get stuff put back after I ripped the, the rug out. Oh, Vicky, I'm sorry to hear that you're in pain. I never like to hear that from anybody. But hopefully you'll be able to recover soon. There you go, Dawn. Yeah, there you go. Thank you. Hi, Kelly. Good morning. Kelly says, I'm a bit late. No, no, you're not late. You're not late at all. No worries. We had some uh, technical issues on our first one, so we had to start a second one. I'm glad you guys are all here to join me. Thank you. Hopefully, we don't have any more issues. I am having some storms here, um, so it's possible that we lose the internet again. If we do lose it again, then we'll just say finito for the day and we'll catch up again next week um but hopefully hopefully that doesn't happen hopefully we'll, we're able to uh finish out the stream here we'll see all right so last row here guys that's it this is crazy that we're gonna we're finishing up the last row today and then we'll sew all the rows up together and then we'll start figuring out what we're gonna do for borders well, I mean, I know what I'm going to do. I just need to figure out what size borders to do. Kelly says we're heading out camping in about an hour. Oh, Kelly, have fun. I know you've been talking about that for a couple of weeks. Oh, that sounds so much fun. Hopefully the weather holds out for you and you guys have an amazing time. Linda's checking her thimbles, getting ready for the next heist. You guys got probably about three more minutes before you can start that again. 
Getting those thimbles all set up. You are also earning some extra thimbles every time you participate in chat. I think it's like two or three extra thimbles. It's just my way of saying thank you for participating. Um, for those of you new to the channel, the Thimbles is a points program. You're basically just earning points as you sit in here watching the channel with me. Spending time with me. And then that way you can turn those points in for prizes. You have all kinds of fun prizes that you can win. Well, actually there's only one on the channel right now. If you do exclamation point prizes in chat, it'll give you some information about how to claim those prizes. Right now it's just a random fat quarter. You do need 10,000 points to earn it, uh, but I'm going to fix that because that seems a little high. I thought it would be easier for you guys to earn those, but it's a little bit more challenging, so we're going to change that. Kelly says it's supposed to be beautiful and then rain when we get back. That's usually how it works, isn't it? Well, I hope it stays beautiful for you for your trip. It appears that some of my layer cakes were not quite 10 by 10. I probably should have checked that, but that's all right. Um, so they're not laying out, laying up just as nice as I would like them, but that's okay. Let's check in. I'm sorry for all the orange coloring. It looked better on the first stream. I think it's just the internet connection now. It is what it is. Sylvia said we had a beautiful day here in the UK today. Oh, I have been to London a couple times. It is just gorgeous out there. I know you guys had some nasty hot weather, like record setting hot weather a couple weeks ago. My goodness. Normally your weather is not that bad, but I'm glad it's better now. Kelly says, I will be filming while I'm gone, and I have a camping video late next week. We're coming home on Wednesday. Ooh, that sounds like fun. Oh, Dawn asked Vicky how her husband's doing. I didn't know your husband was doing unwell, Vicky. Please let us know. Is he doing any better? I never like to hear it when, uh, People are not well. Oh my, this one is really small. What happened here? Jeez, this one's really off. Why is this one so far off? All right. Thirty degrees Celsius. Yeah, I had heard that. I had heard that it was like thirty degrees Celsius, which for those of you that don't know, I think that's like it's in the nineties. I wanna say it's like ninety six degrees Fahrenheit out here. And for them that's just unbelievably warm. For me that's a normal <laughs> summer day. Um, but for them it's it's record setting heat for them. Vicki, I'm glad to hear your husband's feeling better. That's good to hear. Alright guys, two more left for this row. And then we can start sewing the rows up together. I can't believe we're almost this done. I'm telling you, if you guys have an extra layer cake laying around somewhere and you're just not sure what to do with it, you can make that layer cake. And that's it. No other fabric. That layer cake into a quilt using this pattern. It, it's super quick and easy. Super simple to do. I cannot believe how quick this went together. Cannot believe it. 
So apparently I didn't square up my blocks before I started, so some of them are a little off. My fault, but we'll make it work. We'll make it work. Come on. Oh, looks like somebody's trying to start another heist. I don't think it's quite time yet. I think you got a few more minutes there, guys. Yeah, it doesn't look like Streamlabs has taken those yet, so give them another minute and then they'll, you guys will be able to start with those. My machine decided to eat this corner and so now I not get this big chunk of thread sitting there. I'm trying to get through. Oh my goodness. Alright, well, then you're just going to have to come over to this side because you're being dumb. Kelly says, we've been having normal summer temperatures lately, about 27 to 30 degrees. In late July, it was 38 to 39. Too hot. Yeah, oh yeah. and that's in Celsius. Yeah, so that's that's warm for Yeah, that's, that's about average temperatures for us up here in northern Illinois in the States. Um, it's usually... Um, 80, high 70s to high 80s is the average for us here. I think that's like the high 20s to 30s for you guys. That's about average. There we go. Come on. There we go. Yeah, there's like this huge piece of bulk right here because of all this thread. Alright. Let's see what we got. Alright. Last block for this row. And then we can get these all, the rows all sewn up together. Oh, congratulations, Terry. It sounds like she's pregnant, so that's exciting. Oh, I didn't read that. I spent the summer when I was pregnant in New York in a blackout. Nine months pregnant and sitting on the porch with the neighbors and a chest of ice. Oh, <laughs> I bet. Yeah. I, th I thought that was meant you were pregnant. No, sorry. <laughs> yes, being pregnant in the summer does suck. Um, luckily for me, when I was pregnant with my girls, my twin girls, um, I was pregnant basically over the winter. Um, I got pregnant in July and then they were born in March. So I, I got lucky. I was pregnant over the winter, which if, if you have a choice, that, that is the preferred method. <laughs> I remember standing outside in the middle of February, which in February by us, it's really super cold. It's probably the coldest time of the year for us is in February coldest in the most snow and I remember standing outside without a coat on just standing out there just enjoying the nice cold air <laughs> so Terry she says lol I'm a grandma now <laughs> well that's what happens when I don't read <laughs> Vicky, you were able to successfully start the heist, so if you want to get in, now's the time, guys. It looks like that timer finally went off. So you can go ahead and get in there and join on that. Good luck to all of our entrants. I hope you all win. Alright, and now this is row... What is it, six rows? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, row six. Okay, guys, so all the rows are sewn up together. Now we just got to sew the rows. Well, the rows are each sewn, and now we have to sew the rows up together. And then the quilt top is basically done other than borders. We'll need to figure out borders. I don't know that we'll get to borders today. 
Um, we'll have to wait and see. I haven't even looked to see what time it is. What time is it? My watch has died. That's nice. Oh, it's 11.30, so we got about an hour. Okay. I usually run my stream till about 12.30. Um, that way it gives everybody kind of time to reset before all of the other the other YouTubers are on. I know uh, Teresa Louise is usually on about 3 o'clock, I think she usually starts Eastern. 3 o'clock Eastern, I think. 3 or 4 Eastern. And then um, Tiffany is on later this evening, this afternoon, 5.30, I think. And somebody said Ian is on tomorrow, and um, Sean was on this morning. He did not have a live. I think he did, just had a video this morning. If you have not, you need to go check out his koalas. They are just absolutely adorable. I need to find out from him if those are paper piecing or if those are just blocks, because I'd love to try one. They're so cute. I don't know what I would use it for because I don't really have a need for koala blocks, but I think it would be fun. Alright, so here's rows one through six. We're just going to sew those up together real quick. <laughs> Don says, thank goodness none of us are pregnant. <laughs> well, at least no one on the live stream. I mean, maybe one of my subscribers is. I wouldn't know. And if you are, congratulations to you if you are. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, the koalas are pieced. Oh, okay, thank you, Sandra. Well, Terry says she thinks they're FPP. I'm not sure. Marie says they're traditional piecing, Danny. I well, I then I need to find that pattern because they are adorable. And Kelly says right. My son is 21, and he was I was smart and had him in February. Ah, my daughters are also 21, as is Lucas today. Lucas is 21 today. Our moderator, Lucas, I think he must have stepped away. Oh, Elizabeth Hartman. Thank you. I'm going to have to... Let me write that down. If I had somewhere to write it down with. You said Elizabeth Hartman. Let me grab some paper. I want to check that out and see if I can find it. Because I think it looks like a really cute, fun block to make. I don't have a necessarily a need for it, but I would like to, to try it. So Koala is Elizabeth Hartman. I think that could be something fun to try. Thank you for that. I'll check that out later. Oh, no worries, so Terry. We we all guess sometimes it's fine. No worries. All right, so this is row one. This is the top. And then this is row two. This one goes underneath that one. So I'm going to open this one up first and put this one on top of that one and then match up my seams. Excuse me, my goodness, I'm so sorry. I had some orange juice this morning and apparently it is biting back at me. Grab a couple of stitches here. That was weird. Oh, probably for the emojis, I don't know. Oh, Tracy says, I lost my thimbles. Oh, well, yeah. So, Terry, go earn 75. Craft Symbol Life won. No, you won some. You won 750. And Sylvia won. Oh, I'm sorry. Dawn says she lost her thimbles. I'm sorry. Yes, Tracy won some. <laughs> Sylvia says, thanks. I'm just not quite sure what I just won. Well, all Sylvia, what you've won is you've won some additional points. 
Um, so the Thimbles program is a points program. You just earn points as you're watching the channel, and you also earn points as you participate in chat, and then you can turn those points in for prizes. Right now we only have one prize. If you do exclamation point prizes in chat, it'll tell you a little bit more about it. Um, you do need about 10,000 points to earn that prize right now, but I am going to change that. In fact, since I have my notepad here, I'm going to make a note here. Change prizes. I'm going to make some changes to that, and then um, I also have some other things that I want to put up on there, some random notions and things like that you can earn as well. But that's what you've won, my dear. You've won some additional points towards prizes. You earn points for uh, as you're watching the stream, and then you also earn a couple of additional points every time you participate in chat. Dawn says, my son was born, my son is 23, was born in February, February as well. Lots of babies born. And 2000 to 2003. <laughs> my daughters were born in March of 2003. They're... 19 this year. Uh, craft. Uh, Tracy, it's uh, exclamation point top for the leaderboard. T O P. That'll tell you who's earning the most points so far. There's also a slot machine you can play too, although I have yet to see anyone actually win on that one, but you do exclam exclamation point slots, space, and then the amount of thimbles you're willing to risk, and then the computer automatically runs a little slot machine game for you and gives you some, either awards you some prizes or not. I haven't seen anybody win that one yet, though, I gotta say, so be careful with that one. You're probably gonna lose. <laughs> Come on, there we go. There you go. Chloe. Chloe is winning right now, and I don't even think she's on today. I haven't seen her. Chloe, if you're here, make sure you say hi. I haven't seen you yet. But she's the one that currently earned the most points so far. Brenda's short, not far behind, and then there's Lucas. Tracy, you're up there. So is Vicky. Teresa Louise has got some, too. And look at that. I've got 407. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. So Terry says, you are right, the koalas were a PDF pattern listed by Australian animals on her site. They look so crisp. I'm jealous of her skills. Amen. We're all learning, Terry. We're all learning. I am not an expert, hence the name of my channel. <laughs> I make a lot of mistakes. I do not sew perfectly straight lines. I try to, um, but I don't. So, you know, you just, you do what you can. Practice makes perfect, and you just keep trying. Elizabeth Hartman patterns are very well written. They will make you sew like a pro, Dawn says. Well, then I think I'm going to need to check those out myself. I was telling you guys about it last week. I have a, I have all the pieces cut up for a paper piecing project. It's not anything extravagant. It's one of those um, Sew Emma paper piecing projects. So it's um, Fat Quarter Shop. <laughs> Fat Quarter Shop has these uh, foundation paper piecing paper pads um, that you can use 
for various things and so they sent us one in one of their jolly boxes last year's jolly box I think um, so I have it all the pieces set up and ready to go oh my it looks like I had some I missed a little sewing there um, I had all the pieces ready to go cut up already I just don't have them uh, I just haven't started to make the pattern yet I've got a little bit of a piece here that didn't quite make it so I'm just gonna re-sew it just this little piece right here There we go. Kelly says, my meditation quilt is going together reasonably well, I guess. Ooh, a meditation quilt. That sounds like fun. On their amazing patterns. I love her sloth and her lemur. Yes. Yes. I'll have to check out the sloth. That could be fun. Oh, Linda tried to play the slots machine. Did you win? Oh, you lost your 20 thimbles. I'm sorry, Linda. I told you, no one is winning that game. I think I have it set up wrong. I'm going to have to look at that. I'm just finger piecing or finger pressing these uh, seams here in between the rows just to kind of make my life a little bit easier. I bought the It's So Emma pad for snail trail blocks, but I don't know when I'm going to start that project, Marie says. Yeah, Marie, I've had the, um, these are... flying geese. I think they're five inch flying geese. Um, and I got that in the jolly box from last year and I have yet to start it. Um, I've just finally finished cutting all the pieces for it. Oh my goodness, so many pieces. Um, I just finally finished cutting the pieces up for that. So I'm going to start that. I haven't decided if I'm going to do, I think I'm going to do the blocks, the paper piecing blocks. I have the hiccups now, I'm sorry. Um, the paper piecing blocks on the channel is during a live stream, and then I'll do the other blocks in a video, and then we'll put the whole thing together either on a live or a video. I haven't decided yet. But I'd like to do the, the paper piecing project on a live with you guys so that you can help me figure out how to do it because I've never done one before. <laughs> so if I run into trouble, you guys can help me out. <laughs> Yes, Don says the slots are rigged, lol, just fix, he knows, amen, that's why I said I don't think anybody's won that one yet, so enter at your own risk for that one, <laughs> for sure. I'm pretty sure that was row one, let me just make sure. Make sure I'm doing this right. Nope. Glad I looked. Goes this way. There we go. Let me grab that row one tag and mark that one again so that I don't get myself all confused. Streamlabs just reminding you guys to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Please do so. It really helps out the channel. We're at 120 subscribers so far. The channel just keeps growing and growing. It's amazing. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much. There we go. Mm, I don't think this is right. This, this is row three. Hang on. I feel like I did something wrong here, guys. Give me a minute. Row three. Okay, yes. Yeah, so this is upside down. 
Row three goes this way. See, this is why I have to keep flipping things around and checking that pattern, make sure I'm doing it correctly. Sylvia says, I just hit 209 on my channel this morning. Oh, Sylvia, congratulations. I didn't realize you had a channel. Um, oh, Lucas isn't here to post it. Um, is it the name of your channel? If you can give me the name of your channel, I'll make sure to get a um, link set up for you. Just leave the name of it in the chat and I'll get it set up for you. I didn't realize you had a channel. Otherwise, I would have been promoting it already for you. <laughs> Kathy and Kelly, they're in there already. But yeah, congratulations, 209. That's super exciting. I, I'm still floored at the fact that I have 120. I, it's just crazy to me. I never expected to have that many. Okay. Sylvia says it's called You and Me FPP. Oh, well, cool. I will write that down. Give me a second here. I just wanted to start this. Sylvia equals you and me FPP. Okay, Sylvia, I'll get a link set up for that. So if you guys haven't already, make sure you go check out Sylvia. Um, unfortunately, I don't have a link to her channel yet, but I will. You can just search YouTube for it for right now. I think Lucas had to step away, so he's not able to pull that for us. That's okay, though. He had a job for the summer, so he was just back today, which today is also his birthday. Um, and since it is his birthday, I, I expect that he probably has other plans, so no big deal. No big deal. parents probably took them to the bar already but noon so they're probably open <laughs> he turns 21 today so oh, Tracy's gonna try and play the slots game good luck to you hopefully that works Probably enough time has passed that you guys could try the heist game too if you're interested in it. It's probably been enough time. I don't have my... I guess I do have the time stamping on. I haven't looked. <laughs> Dawn says nickel slots do not work either. Dime slots it is. <laughs> there you go. It looks like dime slots work. There you go. <laughs> too funny. Too funny. Guys are so much fun. There we go. Oh, Sylvia started a heist. Make sure you get joined in on that. Earn some extra thimbles. Like I said, I will try to fix that so that it's a little bit less thimbles so that to um get those random fat quarters and all those other prizes out. I did not press any of these rows. I probably should have. I didn't press the seams on any of these rows. Um, I'm just kind of finger pressing them as I go. I probably should have pressed them, and they probably would have laid a little nicer, but that's alright. I'm going to give this thing a nice super hard press before we put the borders on. I'll pull my big ironing board out and uh, get them a nice big press then. There's not really a lot of room in this room for a big ironing board, so I usually pull that out in my kitchen. Looks like I got a little bit of a gather going here. There we go. 
looks like some of these blocks were not quite 10 by 10. I probably should have. So lesson learned, you know, when you're buying pre-cut fabrics, always check the sizes. It's it's something I I need to get better at. I just I, I think I'm just too uh too trusting. <laughs> <laughs> so always check to make sure the measurements are right because otherwise you're going to end up with a little bit of trouble but that's okay just hang on to this here everybody's getting in on that heist game that's a lot of fun um, I should up the points so that you guys earn more points as you're watching that way you guys have more more points to play with that's what I should do. Maybe not necessarily uh, lower the amount for the fat quarter, but just increase the amount you guys are earning. Because it's always more fun when you can play with higher numbers. It's always more fun. And it's all free. None of it's actually costing anyone any money at all. It's just something fun to do. So this week you guys will see a new video on the channel which I'm really excited about because we've gotten clue one for the Piazza quilt. I'm so excited to show you guys that colorway. I am already in love with it and I've only just gotten clue one. <laughs> I'm already in love. Um, it is the Michael Miller's Kaleidoscope fabric line. It is gorgeous. If you guys have not checked that out you need to go over to Michael Miller's website and check it out. It is so pretty and I am so excited to see what this quilt is going to turn out like. So I will have clue one, that video for clue one available this week. And then I also got received clue seven in the mail this week. So I went ahead and recorded that video, but that video won't go out until next week. Um, a live stream for next week is kind of up in the air right now. I'm hoping to do one. Um, we're moving one of my daughters, we're moving Tony into her dorm room on Saturday. So if depending on how the week goes, depending on how her move on Saturday goes, I might do a live stream on Sunday. Um, otherwise, there won't be a live stream for two weeks because the next week we're moving our my other daughter who I share this room with, we're moving her into her dorm room on a Sunday. So unfortunately, I will there will definitely not be a stream on the 21st. I think that's the day. Uh, Tracy says, I always need to trim my half square triangles. My quarter and seam isn't the most consistent. Yeah, I think that's where, well, some of these are like a half an inch off. So I, I probably should have squared these up a little bit better, but I didn't. Lesson learned. So this is the first time I've ever used these big half square triangles before. First, so I, I probably should have done that. Lesson learned for next time though. I do have another, I just got another layer cake from my So Yes stash, um, and I've been trying to decide what I'm going to do with that, and I was actually thinking about maybe doing this pattern with it, or something else, I haven't really decided yet. Oh, congratulations Dawn, Dawn has won some thimbles, so did Terry, wow Terry, you're on a roll, you're winning them all. Sylvia has won some. Congratulations to you as well. So has Tracy and Marie. Wow, lots of winners this time. Congrats to all of you. And I'm so sorry to those of you that joined and didn't win anything. Please don't be mad at me. It's all the computer. <laughs> but congratulations to all the winners. Lots of winners this time. Lots of winners. That is a lot of fun. So now you wait five more minutes and then you can play again. So at the at high noon <laughs> you can play again. <laughs> All right guys, that is one, two, three. So the next one is row four. Let's get row four on. Let's get our row four on. <laughs> So Terry says, beginner's luck. Well, you should keep playing until your luck runs out. <laughs> Dawn says, this is a very fun aspect in chat. Oh, I'm glad you have a good time with that, Dawn. Thank you. Something fun to keep things going. 
keep everybody chatting along. Where's my pattern? I need to make sure that I'm doing this right. Oh, I am doing this right. Okay, good. <laughs> Sandra says, I am broke. <laughs> well, Sandra, the good news is that these thimbles don't actually cost you anything. So just, you know, send a few more chats in the chat and then you'll earn some more and then <laughs> you can play again. <laughs> I think it's, it's been a while since I've looked at it, but I think it's 20 minutes for every five minutes of video watching. Or, I'm sorry, 20, 20 thimbles for every five minutes of video watching and it's like two or three thimbles for every chat. So, just please don't spam the chat in order to earn the thimbles. That's not the point. <laughs> oh, I don't think the nickel slots is working, Tracy. I think you got to use the dimes, remember? <laughs> Yes, the slots are sad. Yeah, I'm going to have to look into that a little bit more. I think there's some settings I can mess around with to increase the odds. So that way it'll... Maybe somebody will actually win those. But yeah, I, I need to... Like I said, because, Chase, uh, because Taylor's been home all summer, I really haven't had... Um, I really haven't been able to come in here and do a lot of my ad administrative stuff on the channel. Um, so th some things are lacking, <laughs> and I do apologize for that, but now that she's going back to school, I'll be able to spend a lot more time in here and uh, be able to get some updates going on some of this stuff. Yeah, even the, it should even be pictures, and it's not, and I think I can fix those, I just need to, need to look into it a little bit more. Somebody said hi to Chloe. Chloe, did you stop in? I didn't, I missed you. If you're in here, good morning. Congrats. Thank you for joining us. I must have missed you. I see somebody else said good morning to you, so I'm thinking you're here. Oh, there she is. Yes, good morning. She says she's hopping on for a minute. She's on vacation in New Hampshire with her family. Oh, Chloe, that's so kind of you. Thank you. You didn't need to spend, take time on it away from your family to say hello to us. But that is super sweet of you to do so. Good morning. Happy Sunday morning. I hope the weather is beautiful over by you. It is just gross over here. It's just, it, that's just the best word I can come up with. It's just gross. <laughs> It's rainy, it's hot, it's humid, it's just gross. So I'm hoping it's better by you. Thank you so much for popping in and saying hello. Got a little bit of a buncher going on here. Give me a second. Got some fabric here. Trying to line that up. Looks like Don had to step away for a minute. Not a problem. I appreciate whatever time you guys are able to spend with me. I understand. Sometimes you got other things going on. Can always catch up on the stream later on. The streams are all available on my channel. Usually about a the the video is usually available about a uh, right away on the channel, but the chat usually takes an hour or so, and that's just YouTube going through its its double checks and making sure there's nothing. Nothing bad going on there. I think, yeah. yeah put this one. There we 
go. But Ke Chloe, that's so nice of you to, to pop over on your vacation. I'm so honored. We're just finishing up the Tower Bridge project. I'm sewing up these rows now. We're going to have this quilt top done today. Well, at least the the piecing part of it. I still will have to add borders to it, which I'll probably do in the next one. I'm having a terrible time with these seams today. This is what happens when you don't press things. <laughs> I should have pressed it and it probably would have laid a little nicer. But that's okay. We'll make it work. There we go. But yeah, I've got um, Cotton Cuts Piazza Clue 1 is going to be in the video, uh, video the, mm, the Thursday video on the channel this week. And then next week we will have clue number 6 of our So Sweet Puzzle Mystery. I can't believe, or I'm sorry, clue 7. I can't believe we're on clue 7 already. But that one has gone by so fast. So fast. <laughs> Kelly says I can't visit while camping. We'll be out in the woods with no service. Oh, Kelly, no one expects you to visit while you're camping. No, not at all. You enjoy the time you have with your family. Family comes first. It was super sweet of Chloe to pop in during our vacation, but definitely not something anyone expects to happen. Not at all. We all hope you have an amazing time and it's nice and relaxing. Super st not stressful. <laughs> we have beautiful weather. That's what we're all hoping for for you. Just finger press in the seam here so it lays a little flatter. These corners are kind of angry at me. <laughs> That's alright. Like I said, I'm going to give it a nice hard press. Um, once we're done with it, I'll pull out the big cutting board, give it a nice, nice hard press so that everything lays nice and flat for when we add our border fabrics on. We're going to do a solid black border. And then we're going to be doing another second, like a chunky border. Um, the second border will be a chunky one. And it is, let me see if I can find the fabric. It's this fabric right here. This one right here. It's like the, the ballet signs. I don't know if you guys can see it. The lighting in here is terrible. Um, but it's these ballet signs. So that'll be the chunky fabric, the chunky border that we put on. <laughs> Goes this way. Number five. Oh, looks like somebody's going to try and attempt that slots game. It's almost like she's going to keep playing until she wins. <laughs> she is determined to win the slots game. <laughs> and she didn't win this time. <laughs> I need to check on that. I wonder if the payout is wrong on it. I'm going to need to fix that. In fact, I'll add a little note here since I've got my little notepad here. Check slots payout. There we go. There we go. Oh, 
Oh, no problem, Kelly. We totally understand. You have an amazing vacation. Enjoy your camping trip. Thank you so much for joining us for the amount of time that you were here. We appreciate it. And you can always check the, uh, you can always watch the stream later on if it starts to rain or you need something else to do on the car on your way there. So, thank you so much for joining us, really. Have a great time. We look forward to your camping, uh, stories when you come back. <laughs> No problem. I still can't believe how quick this is coming together. It just, I, just floors me how fast this is all coming together. So quick. Oh, looks like Tracy's started another heist. Must be that time. Exclamation point heist in chat if you want to join. Good luck. Are we on row five? I think there's only six rows. I just, I can't believe how fast this thing went together. Compared to our yellow brick road quilt that took like eight live streams to put together, this one is like, what, we're on three? Is that what we are? This is num part three? Part two? Part three? Lucas! Lucas is back just in time. And he must have heard that heist. He must have heard that heist coming through. <laughs> Welcome back, Lucas. We missed you. Happy birthday. <laughs> I'm going to say that all day. Just ran to the store. No problem. No worries. I figured you'd went somewhere. No worries. You might have told me you left the stream and I missed the chat, so sorry if I did. Just in time, too, because we're on row five. got one more row to do before we finish this thing. Or at least the top, anyway. Like I said, we still got to do the borders. So we'll have at least one more stream for this particular project to put the borders on. Probably a couple of weeks. Tracy says, welcome back, Lu Lucas. Did you buy some adult beverages? And Lucas says, maybe. <laughs> hey, you know what? It's a rite of passage. It's just like when the girls turned 18, I told them to go buy lottery tickets. Because <laughs> it was something they couldn't do the day before. So, we understand. In fact, Lucas, I have some margarita mix here if you wanted to try some now that you're 21. <laughs> Congratulations to him. And congratulations to his parents, too, because they have managed not to kill him. <laughs> no, he's actually a really good kid. He's a good kid. But I tell my kids that they should be thanking me on their birthday that they still get, that they get, or have, that they're able to see you on their birthday. <laughs> But either way, welcome back. We missed you. Alright. Finger press this one. Snow Bunny! Good morning! Gosh, it's been forever since I've seen you. The last time I saw you, you were in the chat for the Soya. It was a couple weeks ago when I was buying some... When I spent way too much money and bought some stuff. Good morning. Welcome back. I'm so glad you're here. Good to see everyone. 
<laughs> Tracy, I say that all the time. In fact, I say that to even some of my engineers at work. I tell them, I said, your mother may have brought you into this world, but I can take you out. <laughs> I say that all the time. Of course, it's just a joke. I don't actually mean that literally, but yeah. Lucas says, oh no, uh... <laughs> Lucas says, I've probably lost my first place flat. I missed a couple chats there. <laughs> Nobody says, who doesn't spend too much? So, yeah, uh, that is true. That is true. That is very true. But it's glad to see you again. Thank you so much for joining us. We are working on our tower bridge project. In fact, we're finishing the uh, piecing today. The next stream will be putting the borders on it. Oh, Great Thimble Race has begun. Looks like Dawn won some things. So did Sylvia. Wow, congratulations. Oh, it looks Terry, it looks like your your good luck has finally run out. Unless of course you didn't join. I didn't check to see. <laughs> yeah. Very cool. Very cool. Alright guys, last row, and then I'll hold it up for you guys to see. Row six. Row six. The audio keeps cutting in and out. That's not good. I do have a new mic, so maybe it's the mic. Kathy says, same here, Lucas. I'm glad you guys are letting me know this. It's, I think it's probably the mic then. I wonder if it's just in a bad spot or um, if I keep hitting it. So I'll have to keep an eye on that. I appreciate you letting me know. Looks like it's working okay. Now everybody tells me it's been cutting in and out. Well, why didn't you say something? Let me try this. Let's see. All right, well, I can't seem to get my other audio to work, so we'll have to go with this one, but I'm glad you guys let me know. This is a newer mic, so if we're having problems with the mic, I need to know about it. Could be signal issues. Yeah, it could be. Um, I'll watch the playback later and make sure it's possible that it's me moving around, too, depending on where I have the mic set up. So I'm kind of messing around with different audio settings, trying to trying to figure this out but I appreciate you guys letting me know now it's frozen uh, oh never mind oh yeah I was messing with the audio sorry I was messing with the audio I think let me make sure I've laid this one out correctly yes this one is right Nobody asks, is this using a layer cake? Yes, nobody. It's actually only using one layer cake. And it's not even the full layer cake. It's only 36 10 inch squares. And then you do a uh, stitch and flip. Mark them down the middle and then do a stitch and flip. And then, s you know, slice them up. And then you sew a dark one with a light one or a medium with a light one. And then you just lay them out together. And basically the way the pattern shows to make these diamond pieces. Uh oh. You guys are telling me I'm having connection issues. That's not good. Let's check something real quick. Okay, well YouTube is telling me I have an excellent con connection so far, so that's good. Um, I'll just say that if by chance we lose the stream, then don't look for a second one or a third one because we won't be reconnecting. So if by chance we get lost, then you guys have an amazing weekend and I'll see you next week. <laughs> but hopefully hopefully we can finish out the stream here. We've got one more row to do, um, so hopefully we can get it finished out. 
<laughs> Sylvia says, Don, you keep beat trying to beat those slots. You keep losing. Don, thank you so much for joining us. We appreciate you being here. Thank you so much for that. You have an amazing rest of your weekend. We're just about finished up here anyway, so it's okay. <laughs> That's right. Ah, too funny. Yeah, hopefully we can uh, get the stream going on. Like I said, we are having some storms and this stuff. I haven't looked outside to see what the weather's like now, but we had some storms this morning, so that could be affecting the audio. Could be me, too. Maybe I'm talking too quiet. Who knows? I didn't even know they had a monthly pattern club, Snow Bunny. Snow Bunny says, ooh, pretty, I should join the Villa Rose monthly pattern club. I'm liking a lot of their patterns. Well, this one is their Villa Rose pattern, and it is it is by Villa Rose, and it is super, super simple. Super, super simple. So I haven't checked out any of their other patterns, but I'm guessing if this one is, I'm, I'm wondering if they're as simple as this one is, because this one was super, especially beginner friendly. Um, if you've never made a quilt before, or you're not very, you know, you're still learning, this is an excellent beginner's quilt, because it, it's basically one block, and it's it's basically two stitches. That's it. It's two stitching lines. That's it. So, super easy for a beginner. gonna how are we doing on connection here guys can you still see me I think my oh the music is still there I have music in my ear that kind of is my indicator when I'm losing connection and it got really, really quiet, so I got concerned there for a second, but I think we're still connected. We're just about done here. Just about done. Marie says, autocorrect is killing me today. Becky from Power Tools with Thread uses a lot of Villa Rose patterns. Power Tools with Thread. I've never seen that one. That must be a new channel. I'll have to check that out. Chloe, hi, good morning. Still there. Nobody says, I've actually been sewing. Finished my cotton cuts for this month today, and today going to be finishing a quilt top. That's awesome. I was just telling everybody that we got our Piazza uh, Clue 1 in the mail, so I went ahead and recorded the video for that yesterday, so that'll be out on the channel this week on Thursday. And then, I'm not, I'm still not sure if we'll do a live stream next week or not. It just depends on how things are going. I might schedule it and then maybe cancel it later on, who knows. So keep an eye on the Facebook page for that. Um, we're moving my daughter on Saturday, and I'm just not sure how, how exhausting that's going to be. <laughs> Um, and if I'm going to have the energy to, to do the live on Sunday morning, we'll have to wait and see. But I'm definitely not doing a live stream on the 21st, which is the next weekend after that. I'm definitely not doing that one then because we're moving Tony in. Sylvia says, I've been sewing a patchwork jacket, done the lining today. Oh, Sylvia, I have tried to do garment uh, sewing before I made some Halloween costumes for my kids and I just I don't enjoy it as much I wish I did enjoy it but I just don't 
But I am super amazed at some people, at the people who do, are, who do enjoy it and are good at it, because they can make some beautiful things, especially the, the patchwork jackets and things are beautiful. Alright, that was row six. Row six. Let's move this over here so I don't lose it. Let me finger press this and then I will show you guys what it looks like. Hopefully the pattern came out okay. And you guys can tell me if I'm missing one. Sylvie says, planning to do a video on it eventually. No problem. We understand that. Sylvia has her own channel called You, Me, you and Me FPP. I do not have a link for it in chat set up yet. I will get one set up. But for now, if you haven't already, please uh, go ahead and search for her page over there if you can and get that... Uh, Go follow her. She said she's already at 200 subscribers, which is awesome for her. And if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet and you're, and you're liking what you see and want to see more, make sure you hit the subscribe button. We're already at 120 subscribers so far, and we keep growing, which is awesome. We'll have another big giveaway at 200 subs. Our giveaways usually consist of some... Um, fat quarters, maybe even a little project bundle, who knows, just depends on what I've got in my stash, maybe some notions, some patterns, there's usually a whole mess of stuff in there to choose from. Alright, let me uh, stand up and show you guys what I got. Hopefully you guys can see it. Let's see. Can you guys see that so far? See the diamond? See? How's it look? Do you guys see any pieces that are missing or wrong? I know the light gray can kind of make it a little weird. Let me know if you guys see anything missing or wrong. I think it looks right to me. Let's see. Here's the bottom. Here's the bottom. I think it looks right to me. Let's see. Ever says, beautiful. Ooh, pretty. Beautiful. Thank you. Yep, Kelly. Yep, very nice. Looks perfect to me. Oh, thank you, Dawn. That's so sweet of you. I'm sorry. Tracy. That's Tracy. Sorry. Thank you. Awesome. So, that is row six. All done. So, next thing we will do is we will be adding border. So, I have some... Let me show you what I've got. I look at my black pants and they're full of fuzzies. Oh, boy. Okay, so, now that we've got the top together, we're going to be adding some border pieces, and I have those right here. I have solid black for a border. We're going to probably do a, probably a three inch, I have way too much black fabric. I think I use, I'm going to use this for binding fabric as well, but we're going to do with probably a three inch black, so I just got the solid black from Moda. And then this is another piece that we've got here for a border. And I don't have a lot of this. I thought I had a lot more of this than I do. I really don't. Wow, I only have like a quarter of a yard of this. So maybe we'll do a much smaller border on this. I was thinking I was going to do a big chunk border on this one, but maybe I'll do a nice thin border with this one. Maybe I'll do a three inch border with this one and a chunk border with this one, I guess, because I thought I had more fabric than this, but I don't. That's okay. So this is the fabric that we're going to be using for the border. I'm glad I looked at this and didn't start cutting it right away. And then the backing fabric, which I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's this one here. It is so pretty. It's got beautiful ballerinas and it's got some metallic in it and some grays. And some nice pretty bright pink flowers and it's just absolutely gorgeous so that is the backing fabric for it yeah I think that's what I'll do I think I'll have to do 
Maybe I'll do three borders. Maybe I'll do a really thin black border, like a like a, just like a a one inch, a two inch thin black border. Then I'll do this one in like a three inch, and then I'll do another black border again. Maybe I'll do that. Tracy says such cute fabric. It is cute fabric. It is really cute. This is uh, City of Ballet, a City of Ballet by Canvas. Um, that's this one here. This one here is Pearl Ballet by Canvas, I think. Um, here, sorry for all the crinkling. Let me see if I can get it open. It is... You know, once I pull this out, I'm never going to be able to get it back in there, but that's okay. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's by Canvas. Yeah. It's Pearl Ballet, designed by Greta Lynn for Canvas, is this one here. So if you're interested in that, check that out. And then the layer cake we used was called City of Ballet, which I have not been able to find the full fabric line for it. But if you do uh, exclamation point TB for Tower Bridge fabric in chat, it should give you a link to wherever I was able to find what I could. Sorry for all the crinkling. Uh, for the, this, not for this. This is, you'll have to find this one on your own. I didn't put a link for that one. <laughs> but yeah, so next time we will go ahead and start with some borders. We'll get those sliced up and sewn together. I might slice them off camera because you guys don't need to see me slicing a bunch of fabric for a border, but I need to get this pressed up now. Get it nice and flat. So, yeah. So that's it, guys. Tower Bridge. Wow. Three, only three uh, live streams. Isn't this the third one? I think, yeah, I think this is the third one. Three live streams and this tower, this top was put together minus the borders, obviously. So we'll put, get the borders put on in the next time, the next go round, and then um, we'll, I'll send it off to the long arm. Um, Tony's taking this one with her to school, so I'm not sure if I'll be able to show this one off to you guys on the channel once it's finished, but maybe, who knows, we'll have to wait and see. Marie says, sounds like a plan. Beautiful fabrics. Mm -hmm. Oh, looks like we've got a treasure hunt going, so I'm going to go ahead and keep that going. Marie says, your daughter's going to love it. Yes, she does love it. She's, I mean, obviously she's been home, so she's been watching it being built on the channel. Um, so she's, she's really liking it. She comes in here uh, all the time to see how far, every time she knows I'm working on it, she comes in to see how it's looking. But yeah, it looks really good. I think it'll, I think the, the diamonds actually turned out better than I expected. Um, I don't know what I was expecting, but they actually turned out better than, than that, so that's good. Pics on Facebook were too. Yes, of course. Yes, I do try to post pictures of all of our finished projects on Facebook. I'll probably stamp a couple of this one because it's hard to see the colors. For some reason, my YouTube streams, the, the colors are just terrible, so. I don't know why that is, but it does. So I will snap some pictures, um, and show them on Facebook so you guys can actually see what it really looks like there so if you're not already make sure you follow us on facebook exclamation point fb in chat we'll get you a link to our facebook group um we're adding new members every day i think we're up to like 39 members over there so really exciting we post a lot of pictures i posted a happy birthday to lucas on there this morning um i'd love to see what you guys are working on over there so please make sure you're um posting pictures of what you're working on over there because i love to see them you guys keep me inspired Yep. Streamlabs reminding everybody to like and subscribe to the video if you haven't already. Please consider doing so. It does help the channel out tremendously. And if you're watching this after the stream has, has ended, please leave a comment down below. Say hi. Say how are you. Ask any questions you want. I'm happy to answer them as best as I can. Um, but I think this is it, guys. I think we're going to end the stream here today. Um, I don't have a whole lot more. I'm not going to start on the borders today because that's a lot. we got to get them all measured out and striped up or cut up and things like that so i think we'll we'll do that next time uh next week's live stream is kind of on the air right now i'm probably gonna schedule one on the stream but it's a pop there i'm probably gonna schedule one on the channel but there's a possibility that it might get canceled last minute so keep an eye on our facebook group i'll try and let you guys know what we're doing then um, there's definitely not going to be a live stream on the 21st because like, like i said we're going to be moving um our daughter and for school so 
there definitely will not be one then. But I do have uh, videos going up this week and next week on Thursdays about 7.30 Central Time. Um, so keep an eye out for those. Clue 1 of our Piazza quilt is this week. And then Clue 7 of So Sweet is next week. And then uh, I'm not sure what we're going to be doing after that. I've got a bunch of projects. I really just need to start like planning out what I'm doing here. So hopefully we'll get a little more organized here in the next couple weeks. All right, guys. Thank you so much for joining me today and for watching the channel and for supporting it and for chatting. I love chatting with you guys. I really look forward to these streams every week. Um, I love talking with you guys. Um, it's so much fun. Make sure you follow Kathy and Kelly, um, exclamation point Kathy, exclamation point Kelly. Make sure you follow both of them. I will get one for Sylvia. I will get a link up for Sylvia. And don't forget Sean as well. He's amazing. He's been a huge supporter of the channel so far. And uh, make sure to go say hello to him as well. All right, guys. If you have any questions, you know where to find me. Otherwise, I will see you guys again next week. Talk to you soon. Bye. Looking at my lady, wondering if we're crazy, wilding as of lately. Cause this life is cheap, I'm running out of reasons to skip it or just leave it. Escape from all the heathens.